Hi everybody, happy Friday. Thanks for joining me again today. So this week, I really don't have anything to share. I did have one video go up with a layout, but I already put that in my daughter's um, album, so I'm not gonna dig it out, but um, check out the channel. We had done a hop and um, for making a, um, a layout, stretching it, um, basically called it um, um, Honey, I Shrunk the Layout. So I took and shrunk the inside of my layout to be an 8x8 eight eight and then matted it on a 12x12. 12 12. So it was just showing you different ways that you can look at a sketch or look at an idea and either make it bigger or smaller. So make sure you check that out. Um, there was a lot of fun um, people that hopped along on YouTube and Instagram. Uh, this week, I did make a purchase today. Um, I really am enjoying Sh uh, Shadney's um, Etsy shop with her really unique wood veneers. And I had bought, made a purchase before. So since I'm in the middle of December daily and she came out with a few new things, I did add a few things to my cart that went in line with activities I know that we have planned for the season. One thing that my husband and I are trying to do is watch like one Christmas movie a night. So there was one about watching um, Christmas movies. And I know that we're going to have the grandkids over to Cookie Bake. And we're going to go see Santa at a socially distant um, at and his reindeer at a local zoo. So there was a couple of extra things that I um, got to go in my December daily. So... I finally made my decision on my December daily and I'm going with this book instead of the Traveler's Notebook and that would be because I had signed up for um, Christina Sorge's advent calendar which comes out. Um, we got it so we have our countdown with that and I've seen her do it for a couple years and have wanted to do it so this year I actually did do it and she has some really cute chunky items that I think would have been too bulky for a traveler's notebook and she has some really good prompts and so um, I went ahead and switched it over. Now I'm still not using my bigger album that's my Allie Edwards one because again I don't think I'm going to have as much activity going on this year that would require the bigger fatter book. But um, I had this one in my stash which is a simple stories so it's a smaller spine. And I think this will be a little bit better than the Traveler's Notebook. So I went ahead and did this. And I hopefully I'll get her name right. I believe it's Deborah Shaw. Um, she was on our December Daily Inspiration Facebook group. And she shared this really cool door. And she used this for her hidden journaling for her inspiration page. And I stole the idea. I just absolutely loved it and um, was able to cut out, make it look like the door panels, used one of my um, brads from the stash. Um, I've done all my journaling with my intentions. And then right here, I'm going to be putting a picture of the front of my house. Since I figured this was a door, the picture of my house lit up would be kind of appropriate. And then just put 2020 down the side. So this is 100% a scrap lift, loved it. And I haven't really done, had time to do anything else because I need to print out pictures, but um, I've kind of accumulated my stuff. So hopefully this weekend I can work on this and I will share. The only other thing I did was I did punch a hole with my crocodile in the side. And then I hung one of the tags that I got in my, um, advent calendar and so I'll have little doodads hanging off of here and so if you ever have one of these and you just want to decorate it you can do it by just punching a hole and running it through so there was that and then the only other scrapbooking I did that was not for that project coming up in January I did do another layout in my COVID-19 album I didn't film it and it's just pictures of our backyard um, during the spring after we had got done mulching and kind of reclaiming our yard and making it our new happy place since we didn't go camping this year. And then um, my next one will be, and I realized I didn't print them, is my mom's birthday was in March. 
so I'm a little out of order, but that's okay. Um, because we did a zoom, well, I've got that for Zoom. Um, actually, Easter. So I can't remember if Easter was before or after. I didn't print Easter, and we did Zoom bingo. So I have my little bingo stickers, and I have to still print those pictures, and that will be the next thing in my COVID-19 album. Um, like I said, everything else is pinned kind of for that project. Baby's Got Scrap that's going to start out on January 1st. Um, I did have the making of the L, um, page kits started this week, and I'm doing them every Monday, Wednesday, and Friday. They're coming out with another... Um, uh, layout. I thought there was supposed to be one today, but um, I'll have to check it and make sure. But anyways, those are coming out and they'll be showing you how to put a page kit together if you're interested, or at least my version, because this is the first time I've done one like this big. I've made them for crops before, or I'll make a kit and then make a variety of pages from a collection of papers, but I've never done the individual so this has been kind of a fun project that I've been working on. And that's about it. Um, like I said, I did have a little spend this week. Um, but other than that, it's been pretty good. I'm digging in and getting some stuff used up that's in my stash, um, like Brad's. So I want to thank you for stopping by. I know this was a quick one. Um, I'm on my lunch break, or actually my break break. So I only have a minute, but I just wanted to stop by and give you an update on Friday. So thank you so much for stopping by. Make sure you check out Kathy, uh, Christy, and Moira to see what they've been up to this week. Um, I'm not sure if they're going to be posting today or if they'll get the, them up throughout the week. Um, but they will have updates for you as well. Have a great weekend and we will see you next Friday. And be on the lookout for those page kit videos. Thanks.